Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. In today's video I'm showing you how to make the most amazing homemade chocolate cake from scratch and this is going to be a three layer cake with no measuring cups or scale with just one tablespoon and that's why I call it the five tablespoon cake. So if you are interested let's start by preheating the oven at 180 degrees and then butter and dust your baking tin with flour or cocoa powder and then in a large bowl take two eggs in room temperature with one quarter of a teaspoon of salt and one teaspoon of vanilla extract then add in five tablespoon of oil and that's what I meant with the five tablespoon cake because most of the ingredients we're going to measure are going to be measured with the same tablespoon. Then again, add in five tablespoons of granulated sugar. Give it all a good mix for about two to three minutes. Then add in 5 tablespoons of milk At this stage sieve in 3 tablespoons of dark chocolate powder And five tablespoons of flour. I used self raising flour. And last but not least, sieve in one teaspoon of baking powder. And if you are new to my channel, I post a lot of cooking and baking videos as well as vlogs, so I would love you to subscribe for more content. And if you are already part of me as family, then thanks for your support and I hope you will enjoy today's recipe. Once it's all been mixed well and the butter is smooth, take your baking thing you prepared before and pour in the cake butter. And pop it in your preheated oven at 180 degrees for about 10 to 15 minutes. Then take one cup of milk with two half a teaspoon of instant coffee and give it all a good mix. Once you take your cake out of the oven and while it's still hot, pierce it with a fork and pour the milk and coffee mixture all over it. And allow the sponge to absorb it and that will make it very moist. And now take a pan and pour in half a litre of milk with one teaspoon of vanilla sugar and 120 gram of granulated sugar. Then sieve in 60 gram of dark chocolate cocoa powder. With 50 gram of corn flour. Mix it all well, then put it on a medium heat and let it cook for about 4-5 to five minutes or until it gets thick and smooth. Thank you. 
Once it thickens, add one tablespoon of butter, stir it in until it's melted. Then add in 60 gram of dark chocolate chips. I use the extra dark ones with 70% of cocoa in it. And the last ingredient in this chocolate sauce is one pot of chocolate mousse. And while our chocolate sauce is still hot, take the chocolate sponge we have made before and pour it over it and try to make the surface smooth with a spatula or a palette knife and you have to be quick before the sauce starts getting hard. I'm sorry guys but I lost that clip when I was pouring the chocolate over the cake. Now place it in the fridge and let's make our third layer. Take 140 gram of dark chocolate and melt it in the microwave for about 30 seconds then pour in 70 milliliters of hot double or single cream and give it all a good stir until it's all nice and smooth Then take your cake out of the fridge and pour your chocolate ganache over it. And again, using a spatula or a palette knife, try to make the surface as smooth as you can. Pop it back in the fridge for about 10 to 15 minutes and then take it out for the topping. I sprinkled over some white chocolate, raspberry chocolate and orange chocolate with dark chocolate. And for the last touch I had some pink edible sprinkles so I just sprinkled it all over. And now, as you can see on the video, using a palette knife, I tried to take my cake out of the baking tin. And here's your three layer, five tablespoon chocolate cake ready to serve. So I hope you liked today's video. And if you did, don't forget to like it and subscribe for more. And thanks for watching. See you in my next one. Bye bye.